What is up and is going on guys, Simsy here and welcome back to another episode of my FIFA 15 Real Madrid career mode. To start this episode off, we do have a loan offer for Nacho Fernandez. I don't know why I emphasize Nacho so much. Uh, we did get a, transfer, a loan offer here from Navas to Borussia Dortmund and I'm quite happy to oblige. We can always bring him back if um, Leno picks up an injury, and we we do have a couple of spare um, uh, goalkeepers laying around like Paccio. Obviously, we did sell um, Casillas plus thirty one million to bring Ma uh, not Matt uh, Thomas Muller to the club for thirty one million plus Casillas, which I think was an absolute steal. I don't know, even know for some reason it must have glitched. I haven't even played with Casillas once in this career mode, and he's gone up a plus three, he's 33 years of age, he, sh he should be going down in stats, but uh, no one was going to, no one, uh, I did put him up for a transfer, but I didn't get any offers for him, so I did lump him in with the uh, Borussia Dortmund uh, move. We did get an offer here for Fernandez, 62 overall, um, and we did get an offer here from uh, Kadira, uh, what? Kadira, what? Cohen Thrall, um, for Sevilla, he did pick up an injury uh, pretty early on, well, he picked up a, a four- to three-month injury, which was ridiculous, so he didn't really get a run into the side, and uh, I was actually playing Calavajal a lot more, and uh, yeah, I wanted to loan him out, so we do have the transfer deadline day in this episode, we did get another loan offer here from Middlesbrough, but uh, Carlos Vela from Real Sociedad did go to Barcelona for 20 million, Javi, uh, sorry, not Javi, Martinez from FC Porto went to Tottenham Hotspur. And uh, speaking of Real Sociedad, that is who we are playing in today's episode. And a big deal goes through. Edison Cavani has signed for Manchester City. Now, I actually could have signed Edison Cavani. The transfer had gone through. All I needed to do was accept. Unfortunately, I did. But I did ask for some more money from the board. And they did give me $25 million after deadline days. So that is just a, a bit of a piss take. <laughs> Maybe we could have brought in another striker. Maybe... Um, uh, Cavani or um, Thomas Muller both. But the top goal scorer of the La Liga is currently Sergio Aguero on 17 goals, which is absolutely ridiculous. And uh, obviously Cristiano Ronaldo making the... Um the top three also. But in the last episode, Sergio Aguero had a fantastic episode, starting off with a 3-1 win against Valencia, scoring two goals, and James Rodriguez scored the second. And in the the, four, uh, the second match against Getafe, he scored four goals. Yes, four goals. And uh, we did concede one, unfortunately. But Sergio Aguero is on fire. And that rockets that rockets him to the, the highest goal scorer in the league. And that's why he has 17 goals to his name. Because he scored bloody uh, six goals in the last episode. But Real Sociedad, they were unlucky to score. But like I said, Sergio Aguero is on fire. And I'm absolutely befuddled of how he has not gone up in stats. But Ronaldo finds... Sergio finds Ronaldo, and the shot does get parried off the crossbar. But just the way Ronaldo, James Rodriguez, and uh, <laughs> Sergio Aguero link up is just absolutely incredible. And they get put in some amazing positions as James Rodriguez was there, but the shot was blasted wide. Modric on the outside of the box with the finesse. And what a goal by Modric to make it 2-0 against Real Sociedad and dance that little last few Croatian. That was an absolute cracking finesse. And uh, it was a really well... Like, I fucking love Modric with that left with that right foot. Look at that. There was no chance that the Real Sociedad was going to get to, the Real Sociedad goalkeeper was going to get to that. Diving back towards it, but what a finesse from uh, the 29-year-old. Look at that, just curving away from me. He was gone past him before he even knew what hit him. And that makes it 2-0 against Real Sociedad. But I did bring Muller, uh, the player from Bayern Munich, who recently just signed. He whips it into Cristiano Ronaldo and makes it 3-0. And that is another Bayern Munich player in the team. And he was, I think he was a bit befuddled himself. He ran into the post and uh, Modric there to celebrate with Ronaldo for him picking up a goal in this match as well. But Real Sociedad uh, did manage to clinch one back 
in just before the 80th minute, but at this point in the game, I wasn't really that threatened, and I felt it was no more than an equaliser. But Thomas Muller, cool, calm, and collective, slots his first goal for Real Madrid and uh, in the 90th minute to make it 4-1. And what's a goal there by Thomas Muller. He can play all over the pitch, striker, right mid, centre mid, and uh, he's going to be a fantastic player in the future. Nice little cutback. He waits for the goalkeeper to be drawn out and then capitalises with the shot there to make it his first goal. I'm really happy that he scored. Um, he scored. It was absolutely awesome. And he did pick up a assist as well. So, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you've watched all the way through, I really do appreciate it. Make sure to leave a like on this video to support my channel and this series. And there will be more uh, Real Madrid career mode coming out very shortly. But just before I leave, I do have a simulation match here in the Spanish Cup. Now, I've simulated the whole cup because I simply didn't want to play it. But if we do get into the final, which we will see whether or not I do or not, I will be playing uh, the final. So we are playing against Sevilla. 20 minutes gone. And Eden Hazard just scores before the 20 fourth minute. Will, be, will we be able to hold on? Will Thomas Muller come off the bench and score for us? No. Cristiano Ronaldo makes it 2-0. Goetze, Calavajal. Calavajal. I can never say that guy's name, but uh, Cristiano Ronaldo makes it his second goal to make it 3-0 and we quite comfortably go into the finals of the Spanish Cup. But guys, thank you very much for watching if you watched all the way through. I really do appreciate it. Like I said, make sure to leave a like if you are enjoying this series as much as I am. And above all, remember to go out and have a fantastic rest day after you watch this video. So guys, thank you very much. Simsy out.